And guys, here we are with our first bad end in Toma's route. And the first decision we make is on the fourth, where we don't thank him this time. And this is the first time when he was like, oh my, you're so formal. I'm very sorry that you had to go and buy me a new phone. Don't worry. I just figured it would have been an issue if you didn't have one. Still. <laughs> this is the first time I heard you talk today. <laughs> yas. And now, instead of admitting we don't remember much, we just like, um, I can't answer that question without my attorney. What? You can't answer? Does that mean you don't trust me? Mm-hmm. Uh, well, you see, she doesn't mean to offend, but... Oh, right, he can't hear my voice. In that case, you really aren't in a normal state of mind. Especially the fact that you can't trust me, of all people. Well, I guess it's no use talking about it. The doctor mentioned it might happen, and I'm sure you'll get better in two or three days. And then if not, back to the hospital. That was interesting. So it wasn't very trusting of us to not admit that to him. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um... Ooh, we want Shin to stay with us. Sweet BB, our hero, our shining knight from the normal end. I want you to stay, Shin. Alright, you can go home first, then. That's not alright! And Rosy Cheeks, don't give him those openings that he can take advantage of. I told you before, this isn't the same as the past. Shin might have just been a puppy when he was little, but he's like a wild beast now. Don't underestimate him. A wild beast. Oh, Toma, calling the kettle black. Who are you calling a wild beast? Anyway, we'll both get going now. I'm sure you're still worried, but I'll come by again tomorrow. Oh well, I guess that means I'm leaving. Oh, Shin. Well, I guess that's the end of that. <laughs> I tried, Shin. I tried to get you two together again in this world. <sighs> Let's see. So we weren't worried last night. This time, I was okay. I see. That's good. I was worried all night that my phone would ring at any minute. Okay, now we have to go shopping. And now I say, very formally, I'd like to go to the back alley, please. Why so respectful? Sounds like you haven't fully recovered yet. Mm-hmm. Oh, crap! You're supposed to be more casual with Toma! I know! That's why I did it the first time with Ryan! Alright, then the back alley. Where we shall proceed to pass out. And then we have a new thing to pick on the six. Can we get there? Okay. Alright, first a message from Shin. Okay, nothing's changed with that message. Oh, do we tell him? Ooh, we tell him we got a message from Shin. E. A message? He was supposed to have tests yesterday and today. Is he done already? I'm worried now. I should message him later. Still, it's already noon. I'm getting pretty hungry. That was a nice segue. <laughs> and that's that. Um, same as good. What was the one in the good route that I picked? I think it was Were You Watching Me? Yeah. Were You Watching Me While I Slept? Okay, we've done that before. Done that particular rodeo before. What choices we have today? I think I say. All right, I do ask about the battery. I'm trying to look for my battery. And then he's all suspicious. And then, and then I get to pick the option I would really like to pick, which is, I would like to continue working, please. Are you simply concerned about Maiden no Hitsuji being able to operate? That won't be an issue. Oh, come on. Come on, Waka. Unfortunately, Kent has returned this month after an extended break. There are no issues in covering shifts. But I want to see Kent in his uniform! 
Manager, you don't know how important this is to me. You should prioritize your recovery for now. Oh, but manager... Hello, oh, hi, Ukio. Well, we've done this rodeo before. Bye! <laughs> you and your creepy music. <sighs> okay, and then we have another thing we've... Is it here? Uh, no. It's... Which option was it? I think it's nothing? Yeah, it's nothing. Okay, that before. Okay, and then it's this one, I think, yes. Instead of being like, I don't like anyone but Toma. I can't remember it at all, Orion. Yeah, that's right. You wouldn't know now. Hmm. Alright, then we should go see Iki. And then nothing changes for a couple of days. It's the second choice in the ninth that we have to worry about, so I'll bring you in for that, guys. Okay, now instead of asking for a spare key, I'd, I say I'd like to go outside. <laughs> oh, sorry. Were you bored today? I understand that you'd want to go out if you're bored, but it's already dark. Let's save it for another time. Oh, right. I'll also have a spare key made for this place tomorrow so you can have one. Alright, then he's gonna go borrow our key. Oh, what is happening? Are you finished with your bath? Yep. And instead of saying we could share the bed, winky face. <laughs> like, okay, thank you for making the sacrifice. Well, that's the only real choice. You could sleep on the floor, but I think he would strongly object to that. I guess we should take him up on his offer and sleep in the bed tonight, too. <laughs> Sounds like a plan, Orion. Uh, I miss all my friends, though, in this route. I have no friend support except for Orion. Thank goodness, though, that I at least had that. Thank goodness. Okay, and we do have a different choice today. Bye, Ukiyo. Um, oh, yes. This time we pick... Maybe Ukiyo was actually telling us the truth. That he's not our boyfriend. Huh? Wait. Do you know something I don't know? You're making me feel worried, too. Although it's true that Toma doesn't seem to treat you like a normal girl, so maybe he really isn't your boyfriend. But I feel as though we can trust Toma. Oh, Ryan. I wish you hadn't said that. Okay. And then that's the same. And then today I think we have a different option as well. Right, so saying I actually feel happy. I'm not sure how to feel about it. I see. I guess that means you don't know whether it's a good or bad thing. I mean, you have to be near Toma all the time now. And it's just a little at a time, but a lot of memories are coming back. Right, stuff from when we were kids. Which means he's not our boyfriend! Okay, and instead of waiting up for Toma, we'll just go to bed. Okay, let's do that. I'd like to get outside tomorrow. I wonder if we'll be able to. Anyway, good night! Good night, sweet bug. Okay. Basically, every day there's a new choice. From what I can see. Okay, we gotta get up quietly. And sneak out. And find horrible things in our room. Oh no. Alright. I say... It could be possible. Right. But still, even if we don't think of Toma cheating as a cause of this... He is off doing things that we don't know nothing about. And then we pick, I think you're right. Yes. Okay. And then we run back home. Well, run back to Toma's. 
And instead of disarming him with anger, I just went for a walk. A walk? Do you even realize why you're at my house? Tell me the next time you go out. I was really worried, please. Huh, he got mad. Oh right, what should we do with that diary we brought back? Alright, we'll put it in our bag. Toma, what are you doing? Um, mind if I play some games? Ah, DK2. I have the FPS version of it too, DK3. Wanna try it? A shooting game version? That exists? I also have the mystery version, DK4, the horror version, DK5, the visual novel version. Visual novel? Hook me up, bro. There's no end to that series! I'll just leave them all out. You can play whichever ones you want. Anyway, it's already late. I need to get going soon. Oh no! Hey, what should we do? Oh, we opened all the emails you got, but we didn't erase any of them, did we? Oh no, he'll know. Uh, don't leave. Why? You need something? Uh... Um, I, uh, it doesn't tell me what to pick after that. <laughs> um, not particularly, but please don't go. That sounds a little selfish, doesn't it? No, she's not being selfish. Maybe not selfish, just like overbearing. Is there some sort of problem being alone? This room isn't haunted or anything. That's not the issue. Hmm. Oh well, I guess I can skip a day. I've got a report to write anyway. Just because I'm home doesn't mean I can play games with you. Got it? Whew, you managed to stop him. But he'll find out eventually. Although it's not like you should feel guilty about it or anything. I mean, they're your emails! <sighs> well, that was harrowing. <sighs> Okay, so nothing happens on the 13th, actually. So I could bring you in for the 14th. I think I'll do that. I'll see you on the 14th, guys. Alright, here we are caught from sneaking out to go to our house again. You're like, is there something you would not want to share with me because you don't trust me? What are our parameters, anyway? Oh. <laughs> that affection and trust is not looking that great. No. No. Then don't wander around. Does this mean that you think even less before you act than I've seen so far? Eh, yes, we'll leave no matter what you say. And I'm gonna say, still say it's okay, Orion. I'm not gonna say, yeah, I think you're right that you're, you're pretty useless. Do you like me? I don't know. <laughs> I see. Yeah, that's right. Sorry. I shouldn't have asked. I just... don't want to see you cry. I don't like it when you're sad or when you're hurting. I want you to smile, and I want to let you smile. Alright, and then we're back to the same old song and dance. Do we have anything today on the 15th? No? I don't think we have anything on the 16th either. Uh, but we do on the 17th. Ah! We can admit to not exactly... Well, I mean, we did come here willingly, but also he did kind of force her to. <laughs> not exactly. I knew it. There's no way she would stay at your place on her own. And if he forced her to come here, there's no way she would just sit by and stay like this peacefully. Well, that's... <sighs> okay, and then explaining the situation to Shin, doesn't like it, and then we don't say anything about him not being our boyfriend. If you look at me like that, it kind of hurts my feelings. Aww, poor Toma. Yeah, you should have shut Shin up. Ugh, I really don't want to admit to being afraid of him. This is terrible. Yes? 
Yeah, I'm sure. There's no way you couldn't be scared of a man like me. Jeez, that was a pretty unexpected nuisance. Oh, and then the worst thing, ugh, yuck. You terrible, terrible Toma. <sighs> okay. Instead of being like, I'm not sad at the current state of affairs. Get me out of here! I can be a sane person in this bad end. Huzzah. Yeah, that's right. It's exactly as you say. We don't have time to be gloomy. I still don't know exactly what Toma's thinking. I'm with you, Orion. And then I... Do I pick... He might? Yeah. He might. I don't want to think about it, but considering the current situation, Toma seems like he could be the enemy. That is, if we actually believe what that man said. <laughs> uh, right, and that's the same. Um, then I can pick whatever here, and then tomorrow is the same stuff. So I'll bring you on the 20th. Okay, it's the 20th now. So when he confronts us about him cleaning out our mailbox and stuff, we're like, you've been doing that? Whoa, whoa, don't pretend like you didn't notice. Oh wait, did you seriously not realize that I was cleaning all that stuff up? You know, I think that's kind of a problem. How slow can you be? How insulting can you be in this bad route? You keep insulting her, man. And this is exactly why I get so overprotective of you. Ah, rationalizing your actions. Overprotective? I think this is way beyond that level. Mm-hmm. You didn't think I knew you went back home. Uh, yeah, you got those senses, though. Um, he wasn't like that before. I wonder what Tomo was like before. Regardless of what he was like, now that you know he's capable of this, it should change your opinion of him. Mm-hmm. Facts, Orion. Facts. But are we a rational person? Really? Alright, we don't thank our captor this time. <laughs> Triple dot. You're being quiet. I guess I shouldn't have said complaining would be unwelcome. Alright, and the day is just going? Can't skip yet, though. Eeky! <laughs> nice to see a friendly face for a change. Huh. Okay, we do have- oh. Memory, but that's not important right now, really. What is important is alternate choices that get us to our bad ending. We don't ask him why he sleeps on the floor. I don't really mind if you ignore me, but you should talk a little. Your vocal cords will weaken and you might lose your voice. Oh. That brought back a memory? I want to see him. Okay, this is the same thing. When we fell asleep and dreamed. Okay, we found a way out. We got our phone. <laughs> Let me see the super suspicious. Oh, how could I have? That's right. There's no way you could have gotten out. That means I really did misplace it. Okay, and that's the same. Okay, and then I'm... Uh, so you did this to make me happy, right? Pretty much. But you aren't happy, are you? I'm sure you want me to let you out, not gather toys for you. That is the sanest thing you've said, for the most part, Toma. I'm sorry. It really won't be much longer. I'll have the evidence I need in just a little while. <sighs> Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's August 23rd. We're almost at the end of our thing. Again. 
Are you a reporter, you silly bug? I'm gonna sass you. Uh, that's the same. Do I pick anything different here? Oh, I can... I want to pick... I don't want to know. Okay. I don't want to know. Yeah, just because you liked someone before losing your memories doesn't mean you like that person now. But if you regain your memories, you might also remember the feelings you had. It might be scary to think that you'll be completely separated from me and all alone, but... You can't just sit by and stay like this. Our phone died! No, Why? Curses! And then... Do you hate me? <laughs> no way. Although I guess it would be natural for you to think that after I did something so terrible. <laughs> I figured you didn't hate her. But there's no way I could ever hate you, Rosy Cheeks. That's the one thing I can say for sure. <laughs> okay, and today's the day we break out and have the thing, and... Uh, I wonder what what is going to exactly happen in this bad ending today. <sighs> Alright, I get to ask the suspicious, how long will you be gone? Because, you know, I don't need to know or anything. Hmm. Depending on the situation, it could be a while if the usual gifts were left in the mail. Oily stuff has to be washed with detergent. It's a lot easier if it's just ink. Hmm. I think it would take two hours at the most. I'll buy you a gift, too. See you later. Uh, you probably will. Hi, Hukio. I still get to book it away from you. <laughs> you wait your turn. Okay, so we should be running in- Oh, there it is! It's starting. Are you really okay? Does your leg hurt? I can understand if you never want to go to Toma's place again, but... Are you planning to go to the cafe like this? That's just too much. What do you mean that's just too much? This is... Like, where else is she gonna go? She needs support from some friends! Rosy cheeks? What? Ah! It's Toma! Why are you here? How did you get out of there? This is bad. The worst! Let's run away, rosy cheeks! On my bad knee? Yeah. Wait, you can't run! There's no way to escape! Hmm. Oh, I see. So in the end, no matter what I do, you'll always run away from me. I see. That's how it is. No matter how much I try to protect you, you always... <laughs> this is too funny. I knew it would only be natural for you to try to escape. But, to think, I'd actually see you like this, face to face. I feel like throwing up. <laughs> How do you think I feel? I was too naive, I guess. If you were going to hate me anyway, I should have done far worse things to you. Oh. Huh? I won't apologize again, or look the other way and do nothing. I'll give everything up and fulfill my own desires. Oh no. What does that mean? What happened to us? Oh, and we're back in our cage! Have we become a vegetable? Good morning, rosy cheeks. Do you recognize me? Or have you forgotten? I think we broke. I'm Toma. Try saying my name. Toma. Yeah, that's good. You'll probably forget by tomorrow morning, but I'll teach you as many times as I need to. I'll always be here. I'll always be by your side. Oh. Hey. Hi. Can you still hear my voice? Yeah. 
I wonder how much time has passed since you've been locked in here. Your mind has been fading away more and more. And I doubt it'll return. Rosy cheeks. Orion. Ah. It's all white outside the window. Maybe it's snowing. It was August when we were in here. Snowing? It's been a few months. Haha, <laughs> the birds are chirping away. I wonder if they're cold. I don't know about the birds outside, but you're not cold, right? It doesn't matter if it's winter or summer in here. But it's dangerous outside. There are so many dangers, you never know what could happen. But don't worry. I'll protect you. I'll always protect you from anything scary. As long as I live, as long as you live, and as long as you're here. Which is forever. Well, always. Oh, that is terrifying! There's even feathers! Holy cows is bringing back Tay's bad end with, uh, with Cutie as a doll. There's even freaking feathers in this. I can't. And this is when I was like, nope, I'm out. But we'll always be together. Yeah, I can't believe that. And she, was she in a maid outfit or was that my imagination at the end? Which was like a favorite of Tay's as well. Tay and Toma are brothers. Confirmed. Confirmed. Cannot be denied. Oh no. Oh, oh goosebumps. Oh. Oh. I think I'm actually looking forward to Ukiyo murdering us in the next one just so that I can get that image out of my brain! Uh, 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 uh.